following is a 24 hours podcast. I think the trip is, is a very special trip for a lot of young kids. Um, I personally believe it gives us kids a chance to be kids, to experience a childhood. Um, these kids grow up so fast um, with, with their certain circumstances, um, with the lives that they're giving. So much is taken from them and this program offers their childhood back. Did you guys like that ride we were just on? Yeah. Yeah? What'd you like about it? Uh, the guns. I like the part when we went down like that. And I like the part with the guns. The guns? <laughs> Weren't you scared? No. no. I was a little bit. A little, little bit? bit? Yeah, because when there was mist with that guy, I thought we yeah. would go down the hill. When there was a little tiny skeleton that was talking, I wasn't scared. It was just telling everyone about the ride. It was a bad guy though. <laughs> I don't know why a bad guy would tell everyone about the ride. Well, he was a helpful bad guy maybe. Uh
got involved when I was uh, 14 actually. I was one of the kids on the flight. I was diagnosed with a form of bone cancer. And after months of chemotherapy and having my leg removed, um, one of the social workers at BC Children's um, volunteered me to be one of the kids on the flight in 98. Back then it was a day out of the hospital. My nurses and doctors did everything they could so that I'd be well enough to come on the trip and that's something I'll always be grateful for and looking back I really realized how much it meant to get away from the hospital, get away from the disease and, and that sort of thing and just get my innocence back, you know, have some fun, be, be a kid, yeah. My favorite ride is definitely the Space Mountain. Twenty four hours dot CA